YouTube! What's going on? It's Kendrick. Hi guys. Wonderful day. It is a beautiful Sunday today. We're coming to you today. So yesterday we went to base, base camp. camp. Base camp in Frisco. And Ron picked up a couple of couple of items you know to say the least. Couple of them things, you couple know. Of items. A so couple of them. We're gonna get right to it. Y'all can probably what I if I showed the bag, y'all probably know what one of them is. Yeah. But uh ended up getting something else. So I don't think they know what it is. They know what brand it is. I know what brand it is. But they don't know, don't what, know it what it is. is. Y'all can guess what it is. And if you, you can guess, guess if you watch, the... you can guess, you're gonna probably be right. It was in the vlog. It so. was in the vlog. In the... Both of them were in the vlog. You feel me? Let's get to it though. Get to it, man. Here you get this one. Yeah, look. First pair. Dang. First pair. Them things. Them super colorful. Cone Air Max 98s, man. Look at this one. <laughs> Ooh, that's funny. Let's not edit that up. I'm not. All right. This Cone Air Max 98s, bro. I ain't never owned the Air Max 98 in my life, but I had to get these. This is my favorite Air Max 98 that I have seen. Easily. Colors complement each other. Easily. Very well. Easily. Very well. Easily. Initially, I thought this whole shoe was suede, but it's not. This uh, this teal part is nylon. I think that's nylon. That's a correct term. Yeah, we can roll with that. Yeah, mm -hmm. I say I say I think nylon. It's nylon. Like, like the the uh, starter jackets. Yeah, it's the starter jacket. That's what I'm gonna call the starter jacket, man. These colors complement each other. This shoe bright. Like, it's very bright. You gonna see me walking down the street? And I things. like bright though. You gonna I see me? Bright. You gonna see me coming? I love Pause. bright. All right, unpause. You did just say that. <laughs> All right. <laughs> but yeah, bro. My, what's crazy is my favorite thing on this shoe is this air bubble. And that seems small, but the inside of that air bubble is teal. It's teal on the inside, man. I think that was a perfect color. I don't think it should have been purple. I don't think it should have been orange nor white. Yeah. This this teal is where it's at, man. That black He's body nice. is where it's at also. Orange on black, it, it just popped, man. This whole shoe popped. These clean, bro. I'm ready to wear these. Shockingly enough, man, I like the black bottoms on shoes. One, it keeps the shoe, it, the shoe yeah. looks cleaner. But uh, sometimes that black just kind of does it, yeah. man. Like, and it's, it stay, I don't want to say it stay cleaner, but it does just, stay cleaner. Like you would not even notice the black on it. It looked better know. over time because your sole don't get beat up too much. It's yeah. as, as opposed to like a white sole. That's the that's first one. pair. That's, that's the first pair. That's pair number one. Next shoe. I'll, I'll handle it. I'll take care of it. Hey. Y'all already know what them is, man. They might not. Them free throw for those, line. For the non sneaker heads. These are the Cement 3's free throw line joints. Now, explain the difference between the Cement 3's and the free throw line. Alright, on the regular Cement 3's, they got a gray bottom. And it doesn't have this line right here. That line is uh, where Jordan dunked, or where he jumped from, yep. where his foot was at on the free throw line when he dunked from the free throw line. Yep. And also another touch, this 147 on the inside of that thing right there. That was his uh, score for that dunk contest. That was his dunk contest oh, score, his final score. Didn't know that. Which is clean, bro. Fresh. A lot of details. Um, details. I heard from older sneaker heads that they didn't like the blue sole on it. I like the blue sole, but uh, a lot of that comes with the nostalgia of the regular ones. They don't want nothing to change on it. Am I an OG sneaker head? Cause I'm 29. Uh, like an older one. I mean, OG. You just gonna say OG? I ain't gonna say older. I don't know. Just gonna it, say OG. I don't know. When did you get into sneakers? Comment down below if me being 29, if I'm an OG sneaker head. Cause I don't know if I would consider myself an OG sneaker. Just based off sneaker. my age. I, I don't like, know. I like shoes. I like Jordan. So I, though I wasn't around when these came out, I still would prefer a gray sole just cause it's the original. Yeah. And as y'all know, I like vintage stuff. You know, so, I've been jaded up since birth though. I mean. Shout out to Pops. Shout out to Pops. <laughs> Flint 13s, my first pair of Jordans ever. When they re-release, I'm getting them, two of them. I ain't gonna even take y'all around this shoe that much, but what I do like is that Nike Air on that buttocks. You feel me? Nike Air on the back? On the booty. On the cheeks? And on the bottom. And on the hang tag. A lot of people saying they keeping this shoe for um, 
Like as a collector's item? No. Man, I'm look, I'm, I wear listen, my shoes. Real quick, you can to me, you cannot call yourself a sneakerhead if you are keeping a shoe just to have it in your collection. Sneakerheads wear their shoes. Sneakerheads get GR releases. Sneakerheads don't just become a sneakerhead overnight. Sneakerheads are sneakerheads by their own Bruh, taste. I wonder if y'all heard my stomach just growl. Like if it's like right by the mic. Bro, I'm hungry no more. Okay. Oh, but yeah, what my, what my brother was just saying. Yeah, man. A sneaker. <laughs> a sneakerhead, bro. Like, I, I'm not... I'm not calling you a hype beast if you only have hype things. I am. Yeah, I am. I am calling you a hype beast because you're not a sneaker. But like, I, I it sounds crazy, but like, you're not a sneaker if you ain't got no <clears throat> GR. Cause I mean, you gonna go to the anybody that likes shoes gonna go sneaker shopping. You know what I'm saying? Like go like I walked in there looking for some shoes. I walked in base camp just looking for some shoes. I ended up coming out with some heat, of course. But I mean, for example, the uh, the the uh, the white all, the, all white threes. The, um, I don't even know what the name of those are. We're just gonna say the all white threes. Go the all there. white ones with the uh, the ice sole on them. I'm waiting on them things to hit them sale racks. Yeah. Cause I like that shoe. I love that shoe, bro. And I don't see why people don't like it. Some people won't buy the shoe because it didn't sell out. Like that's, I don't understand, bro. Like why y'all yeah. care so much about what other people think about what you're doing? If you like something, you like it. Sneakerheads, be sneakerheads. It's okay. Wear what you like. And don't wear what's hype. Wear what you like just because you like it, man. Do what you like, bro. And that goes with everything, bro. Like, stop worrying about what people think of you because people suck. But yeah, that's it, man. Be you. He picked up the what? Do you. I'm going to call them Snow Cone Air Maxes. That's Snow Cone. And <laughs> Free Throw Line 3s. Free Throw Lines, bro. Shoot. You know what to do. Subscribe, share, comment, like, all that good stuff. We will see you guys in the next video. Rock with us on social media, too. I'm gonna delay this piece until I get done with the piece.